initially, the signs of the Day of Judgment are divided into two, major signs and minor signs. The minor signs of the Day of Judgment are the signs that give us a hint that it's coming, but we still don't know how close. The major signs, the moment you see the major signs, that means it's very, very, very close within the lifespan of a human being. And so one of these major signs is the appearance of the Mahdi. What does Mahdi mean in the Arabic language? The Prophet ﷺ described his, the four Khulafa, the four Caliphs after him. He says, al khulafa al rashidin al Mahdiyin. The word Mahdi means rightly guided. So who is this rightly guided person? The Prophet ﷺ said, he said that Allah in the end of times will bring out a man. He will fill the earth with justice and fairness. He will rule the earth. Min ahli bayti, he is from my descendants, from my family. After the earth was a horrible place full of injustice and crimes and earthquakes, then this man will come. Yamliku sab'a sinin, he will rule for seven years. So this hadith, we learn a number of things. The first thing is that you do not want to be alive when the Mahdi comes around. Because the earth will be in a horrible state before he comes along. There will be earthquakes. There will be no justice. People will be stealing each other's money and taking each other's rights. The earth will be a chaotic place and then this man will come around. What is his name? The Prophet ﷺ said, His name and my name are the same. What is the name of the Prophet ﷺ? Muhammad, Muhammad ibn Abdullah. The, the man who is called the Mahdi, his name will be Muhammad ibn Abdullah. And he will be from the descendants of the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa Al-Mahdi min waladi Fatima. That the Mahdi, this man, Muhammad ibn Abdullah, he will be from the descendants of Fatima radiallahu anha, the Prophet's daughter. Also, the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said, يُبْعَثُ عَلَى اخْتِلَافٍ بَيْنَ النَّاسِ فِي النَّاسِ وَزَلَازِلْ فَيَمْلَأُ الْأَرْضَ قِسْطًا وَعَدَلًا He will come at a time when there are so many earthquakes and people are disagreeing and fighting and civil war takes place and then he will come and he will rule and bring peace and justice to the world. What does he look like? What does he look like? The Prophet sallallahu said, Al-Mahdi minni. This man Mahdi, he is from me, from my lineage, from my relatives, from my family. A'la al-Jabha, he has a wide forehead. Aqfa al-Anf, he has a curved nose. They call it a, Ro a Roman nose. You can Google it, you'll find it on Wikipedia. It's a particular type of nose. Now these are two signs. And then there's one more thing about him, that the Mahdi, this man, overnight, Allah will rectify his heart and make him a righteous person. Which means that this person was not always perfect and righteous, but that Allah perfected this person because they are going to take a big job, which is to rule the Muslim Ummah. There will be a Khalifa for the Muslim Ummah for six to seven years. It gives Muslims optimism and it gives us good hope in the future. How did the Prophet Sallallahu describe his qualities? What will he spread in the world? Peace and, and justice. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala did not tell you and me to wait for the Mahdi. Some people call it the Mahdi al-Muntadar, the awaited one. Well, we are not waiting for him. Why? Imagine you are waiting for the Mahdi outside the masjid. You're waiting, you're waiting, you're waiting. Mahdi is going to come and then a car hits you. There was no Mahdi to answer the questions for you in the grave. There's a hadith mentioned about when or where this Mahdi will appear from. There are some hadith that mention that this Mahdi will appear from the area of Khurasan, which is in the area of the Persian Peninsula in Iran. There's a hadith, a hadith which mentions that he will be from, coming from Medina, seeking refuge. There's a hadith that mentions that there will be black flags coming from the east. You must have heard this hadith.